Hello students good morning how are you all i hope you all are fine and doing well in home and also you have watched the first part of tsunami now in this second video i am going to start the explanation of second part before starting the explanation of second part i would like to ask few questions on the basis of first part explanation it will be a just recapitulation for your mind now children take the take the notebook in your hand and note it down, down those questions and afterwards after watching the complete video send me the answers to my personal number okay so the first question is where did ignatius live this is the first question i'll again again i'll repeat it where did ignatius live second question is how many children could save with him him in essence ignatius itself where did how many children could save with him this is the second question third question is who was sanjeev who was sanjeev and the fourth question is how old was meghna yes i know you are answering the questions while watching the video how old was meghna this is the fourth question now fifth question is where did almas study where did almas study these are the five questions which you are sending me answers to my personal number let's move for the explanation this is the second part before starting the second part i just want to clear little bit uh, doubts of yours regarding sanjeev sanjeev he could not save himself yes children he swept away as the last line of that para says here he swept away with that cook wife he could not save himself if the question comes to you uh, in this bravery stories of brave people which we are studying in this topic for example out of these people who could not survive for uh, meghna sanjeev almas javed and one more is telly smith if ignatius not telly smith ignatius if the question comes to you out of these four people who could not survive then answer would be your answer would, uh, would be the sanjeev policeman yes he could not why why because he swept away with the cook's wife this is the doubt which you asked so i thought of clearing here here also now one more thing here almas javed who was studying and who was living with the family here also children she could not save her parents herself she survived however as you know that uh, her parents in front of her eyes uh, they swept away into the water these are the little bit doubts which you were ha having i thought of clearing in the second video now let's move for the second part tilly smith a british school girl was able to save many lives when the tsunami struck phuket beach in thailand though she has won a number of awards her parents have not allowed their daughter to be interviewed on television and made into a heroine why do you think they took that decision children a school girl small school girl who survived in tsunami when she was struck in phuket beach in thailand she survived not only she survived here she saved many other lives after that she was awarded by many awards 
but the problem was that his uh, her parents did not allow her to give interview yes till nowadays media is nowadays also not before also if anything was going to be popular in the incident anything uh, this girl has made the uh, record itself small girl uh, saved the people life then it is a big thing so many people tried many people tried to take her interview but parents did not allow why do you think children maybe maybe the parents are not at all interested to show the face of the child to the publicly or to give the life of celebrity to the child so they did not allowed to do the interviews in the magazines or to media now let's start the explanation of the second part by reading the paragraph now here is a story from thailand the smith family from south east england were celebrating christmas at a beach resort in southern thailand Telly Smith was a 10 year old school girl her sister was 7 year old their parents were penny and colin smith it was children underline the word take the textbook in your hand as well as the pencil it is very ne- uh, necessary don't sit by taking the phone itself take the pencil and now underline in your textbook the word resort and the meaning of the word resort is a place where people go on holidays or vacations next it was 26th december 2004 deadly tsunami waves were already on their way they had been triggered children underline another word triggered the meaning of this word is a sudden violent reaction and and see earthquake caused with the tsunami by a massive earthquake of northern samatra earlier that morning the water was swelling and kept coming in penny smith remembered the beach was getting smaller and smaller i could not i did not know what was happening but tilly smith sensed that something was wrong her mind kept going back to a geography geography lesson she had taken in england just two weeks before she flew out to thailand with her family tilly saw a sea slowly rise and start to form bubble and form whirlpools children underline the word whirlpool whirlpools i'll show the picture of whirlpools it will be easy to under, uh, understand this see pictures whirlpools these are called whirlpools the water which takes the shape of circle and which rotates and which takes all the objects in it with heavy force and nobody can survive in this whirlpools so this these are called whirlpools and i hope you understand it now she remembered that she had seen this in the class in a video of a tsunami that had hit the hawaiian islands in 1946 her geography teacher had shown her class the video and told them that tsunamis can be caused by earthquakes volcanoes and land landslides tellly started to scream at her family to get out get off the beach she talked about an earthquake under the sea she got more and more hysterical hysterical children underline this hysterical hysterical in a sense when you are hysterical in that zone of mind then what you will do you will shout loudly you will laugh or you will cry you will show the wild excitement yeah this is the meaning of the word you can get it in glossary also said her mother penny i didn't i do uh, i did not know what a tsunami was but seeing my daughter so frightened yeah underline the another word frightened fearfully the word meaning is fearfully i thought something serious must be going on tilly parents took her and her sister away from the beach to the swimming pool at the hotel a number of other tourists also left the beach with them then it was 
as if the entire sea had come out after them i was screaming run run the family took refuge underline the word refuge the word is shelter shelter in the third floor of hotel the building withstood withstood underline the word withstood the meaning of the word withstood is to tolerate the sharg underline the sarg not sharg sarg underline the word sarg it is uh, uh, this mean here force of three tsunami waves if they had stayed on the beach they would not have been alive the smith later met other tourists who had lost entire families thanks to tilly and her geography lesson they had been forewarned forewarned underline the word forewarned in advance warning children the meaning of the forewarned word is advance warning about anything tilly went back to her school in england and told her classmates her terrifying tale underline the word terrifying terrifying in a sense scary terrifying tale story tale in a sense story now children in this part we are going to uh, analyze the character of tilly smith who was only a 10 year old girl who was studying in her, in the school at the uh, in the 2006 uh, in 2004 26 december the complete family few days before complete family went for a holiday to celebrate the christmas so she too went with her parents parent and sister also they uh, they had taken shelter in the hotel and that day when the tsunami caused that time they were enjoying in the at the beach of the sea suddenly uh, tilly was observed noticed the recede of water which was going back and also she has seen a uh, whirlpools in the water then her father also noticed the same thing but he could not identify what is going to be happened in the future he could not understand it but tilly understand because she had taken the lesson of this tsunami f- uh, from her geography teacher and her geography teacher has shown a video of this whirlpools volcanoes this tsunami in her class and she in she warned the students before itself then at the moment of life she recalled these all the things when she has seen those whirlpools of water then with hyperness she started to scream she started to shout very loudly and she said to everyone to come out from the beach they were enjoying in the beach then everybody came out and all the tourist not only this family of tilly smith tourist also who were present there beside of them they too came out from the swimming pool and they uh, went to the third floor of the building they had taken shelter at the third floor of building and fortunately fortunately the building was tolerated the very heavy three waves of tsunamis yeah then because of tilly smith tilly smith recognized the waves of tsunami she saved the families of other tourist as well as her family so she was one of the brave girl in this story she was only 10 year old and not only she saved her mother her father and her sister she saved here other tourist and who stayed there only they lost their life after that incident she went to her school and she shared her this story with the classmates and teachers and afterwards she was awarded by many of the awards children i have little 
i i just want to say you one thing here as i have been observing here if teacher was not educating her about it then is it possible to identify the waves of tsunami no then indirectly teacher is a biggest role who is playing in the life of in the bravery of the this girl now i hope you understand the first second part explanation in the second part of explanation i have list out these new words you can note it down in your textbook as well as in the class book take screenshot of the new words list many other also i said these many you can list it uh, list out in your class books and one more thing before ending this video i would like to say you that every time now onwards <coughs> whoever will set to watch this video you are going to give me attendance yes how by commenting in the comment section for example by writing your name first you are supposed to write your name as prathiba present ma'am otherwise purvi present ma'am otherwise gauri present ma'am or x y z present ma'am every one must and should give your attendance in the comment section then i'll be knowing about how many of you are watching it sincerely then also i need your answers of question which uh, questions which i have given in the beginning of the video five questions five answer you are supposed to send me to my personal number thank you children for watching the video completely goodbye take care